Hello, people's names of YouTube. I just said notes. Oops. My name is Texas the Masker. We're here today with a new video. And today, we have to start the final run that I will play on Undertale. The genocide run. I've already done my somewhat neutral. I was a complete and total asshole. Mistakes were made. I finished my true pacifist, and now we're here. Without further ado, let us begin. That's not supposed to be a pun because it's a plant. Monsters have returned to the surface. Peace and prosperity can move across the land. Take a deep breath. <sighs> There's nothing left to worry about. Well, there is one thing, one last threat, one being with the power to erase everything, everything everyone's worked so hard for. You know who I'm talking about, don't you? Mm-hmm, he's talking about me. I'm gonna hate this run. I still have the power to reset everything! If I so choose, everyone can be ripped from there and sent back before it all happened. No one will remember anything. I'll be able to do whatever I want. That <laughs> power. He knows it. That's the power I was fighting to stop originally. But now, Red Rum has a name to live up to. Don't worry, I'll do it for you. No. No. Frisk is not allowed to live Frisk's life. Their name is not Frisk! It is Red Rum! But... You can't change your mind. Please tell me I'm... I'm not recording this with full... Mother of God, damn it. No, I am. I am, it's just not centered. Don't mind the video, just gonna center. <laughs> yeah! Now that that is all centered, I, I apologize for that, I didn't realize it wasn't. Here we go. If I do end up racing everything. That's fine. Nah, this is my second time reading through it. I just wanted to have this for the recording. Thank you, though, Flowey. <laughs> now, a few of you who actually played the game are going to actually understand that. People who have never played the game, that is just what it comes to when you start the game after finishing your true pacifist ending. Because now everyone is happy. Why would you want to play the game more? Shut up, game. But unfortunately... Red Run's time is over in the throne room. It's time for the true reset. The new fallen human. Well, their name... Shall be... what it was meant to be originally. Because I don't have enough room for Massacre. I only have six letters. Yes. Yes, it is.
As soon as I find out. Wait a minute. That should lower the volume that you guys hear at. I hope so, anyway. Because that is actually supremely loud. There we go. Yes, I am new to the underground. No, no I'm not. Try me, Wowie. <sighs> no trust. No rest for the literally wicked. Friendliness pellets. <laughs> Bullets. Friendliness pellets. Yes, I do. I don't really give a shit. Ah, shit. Aren't you just one satanical bastard? Fireball! Blip! You say innocent, but my name is Murder. I will guide you through the catacombs. I mean, I could have showed you guys hard mode, but... There's no point, it doesn't let me leave the ruins. If you're wondering what hard mode is... Hard mode is literally the culmination of what happens when you name your player what their original name is. As in Frisk. If you name your character Frisk, hard mode is enabled. But that only lasts until the end of the ruins. A frog it will stop your fight with Toriel. And Toriel will be kind of pissed about it. I hope this isn't too loud. Because even after I turned the volume down, it was still kind of hurting my earballs. I hope I'm loud enough. This is half the problem I had with the Talos Principle. The other half was actually getting into record. Oh, no, I'm not in the game anymore. Oops. There we go. Alright. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones you need to flip. Yeah, don't mind how I read them. Because I just like skip throughout the dialogue, and people probably want to know the dialogue. It's been diddly dumptious. I don't want to move on to the next room, bitch. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you want to fight. While you were in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stop for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Oh, I'll practice. Beating the crap out of this dummy. With a stick. With a stick. The dummies are not for fighting. They are for talking. We do not want to hurt anybody, do we? My name is Murder, have you not caught on yet? Blah 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 this blah 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 that. Oh... Can I snipe this frog yet? BOOM! Ah, 
So much fun. Murdering. This is the puzzle, but yeah, take my hand for a moment. Damn it, Toriel. I'm not going to have you to literally hold my hand for much longer. I'm gonna have to make a painful choice because my name is Murder and I have to live up to my name. Yeah, my um, um my quote unquote neutral run, um, it was a mock up genocide run. It was getting me ready for the genocide run I was gonna do. It tore me apart. I, w I was able to hold it together until Sans just like dug into me and I was like on the verge of tears I felt so bad and I'm like I've done wrong I don't want to play anymore but I finished the game Ugh. oh god recording this oh shite so recording this after Flowey's back <laughs> that's gonna be fun uh, not really yes I have Oh, it's a very difficult request. Oh shit, guys. I don't know if I can do this. She wants me to walk to the end of the room by myself. I, I don't think I can, Toriel. I'm gonna have to exact vengeance on you. I never noticed that the music changes. Also, I'm gonna have to go back and make sure I clear out all monsters in the area. The unfortunate part about the genocide run is, well, you know, going back and having to kill every last thing until nobody comes to the battle. That is, like, highly unfortunate. Oh, look who's hiding behind the pillar. Worry not, I was hiding behind the pillar the whole time. Yeah, I know. I talked to you. I don't trust you. Oh? Yeah, I am very independent. See, my name isn't murderer in... partner in crime of murder, it's just murder. Meaning I murder people. Me, alone. This guy murders people like you. Not you. Her. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. Then I took it. And I threw it on the ground! Sorry, I can help it. If you have a need for anything, just call. Yolo, you got pizza? Oh, you're right in front of me? Could you grab me pizza? No? I'll keep We. Oui. Oh, god damn it. Yes, I have. No, you don't. I don't care. I would be good, all right. Click. Nope. Playfully crinkling through the leaves fills you with determination. Leaf pile. Ooh, what's up here? Oh. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. How disgusting. Dude, piece of candy. You feel like the scum of the earth. Well, I kinda am. Dude, piece of candy. You took too much too fast. The candy spills on the floor. I can't even interact with it now. But I have candy. Uh, poor Wimson. Boom! I'm just gonna do a run where... Okay, so here's how I think I'm gonna do this. What I'm gonna do... Is I'm just going to... Play up until I get tutorial. That should be about the time of recording. And then I'll just head back. And I think I'll just do clearing out rooms as exhibition episodes. Like... For example, this episode will just be Undertale True Genocide Part 1, and then I'd just be getting through the ruins. And then, instead of making Killing Everything in the Ruins Part 2, I would just call it 
Undertale of True Genocide Room Clearance Ruins. Yeah. Oh, crap, that also means I gotta find that one boss. Anyway. Hello, this is Toriel. I'm gonna change my voice every time for it. For no reason in particular, what do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Cinnamon! Duh! I mean, it's not like it's ice cream. I don't think it's cinnamon. Oh my god! Uh. Uh. Yes. Oh, I didn't get to say that. That is unfortunate. Pushing rocks onto. I can't even finish a sentence now! You do not have any allergies, do you? Huh? Huh? Why am I asking? Oh, no reason. No reason at all. She's such a bad liar. Sorry I couldn't one shot you, Froggit. Let's see if I just remember this off the top of my head. Oh, snap. Totally did. I think monsters spawn down there and in that room, but... As I said... I'm not doing room clearance until after. Boom. Pop off. Cool, cool. God, I can't wait until I get the toy knife. Ah! Ribbit, ribbit. Come at me, frog. You failed, frog. And now you're dead. Yay! Did you know that two out of three rocks like to be pushed? I did. Not really. I'm more telling you to get your ass in the pressure plate. Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Isn't he just a douchebag? This is the douchiest rock I ever made. Too bad I can't kill him. There we go. A douche nozzle. Thank you. Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese, it fills you with determination. Oh, right, I forgot. Doing the true genocide run, you can't get the Temi armor. Not that I've ever actually needed to get the Temi armor, it's just like, oh, right. Top! Are they gone yet? Z -z 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 -z. <laughs> We're gonna have, gonna have to get very forceful on Naps to Blue. I love the music. God damn it, Naps to Blue. Really not feeling up to it right now. Sorry. I'm fine, thanks. You're bawling because I'm beating the crap out of you. Well, not actually, you're a ghost. Four shadowing. Did you know that you actually can't beat the crap out of ghosts? Faint odor of ectoplasm permeates the vicinity. You do know you can't kill ghosts, right? They're sorta of incorporeal and all. I uh, was just lowering my HP because I didn't want to be rude. Sorry. I just made this more awkward. Can you beat me? Rude. 
I lost an experience point. One experience point! That's not even worth a frog at. Although I do feel bad for killing Navstablu, because Navstablu is awesome. Leave seven gold in the web. Do it. Don't let your memes be dreams. Same with this. I got me some apple cider and an apple or er, spider cider and a spider donut. Ribbit, ribbit. I heard using F4 can make it. you have a full screen. I know that. Four frogs! I have only seen a maximum of three frogs in this room. This is troubling, to say the least. Ribbit. Well, that's why you can't full screen. Wait, three? Yeah, one of them is missing. Ooh, Luke's. Your boot die. Please tell me to come. Now, is this one of the ones where I can get them a um, mum? The one thing that's actually really nice about doing genocide runs or just martyring people runs is there are ways where you can betray them, earn their trust, and then totally give them, make them regret their choice. But honestly, I don't think I can do that with Luke's. I'll try it in my um, um, room clearance, but <laughs> what an eyesore, but um, that was a good one. You only have one eye, too. But now you're dead, so you have no eyes. Yeah, there's usually three frogs. What the hell? Oh, it's because I killed that one frog it. And that frog it belongs here. <laughs> Quite merciful for a human. I'm here to kill everything. It's bad. No more yellow names. I wonder if that actually holds through the entire game. There are probably lots of things lying about here and there. I think Toriel has a hidden dildo collection and he doesn't want to tell anybody. Ah! I think I'm actually going to call it a park here, I'm just going to go to, um, um, just going to finish this puzzle, hopefully Toriel's thing is just over the horizon. I'll grab the, I'll show you all where the toy knife is if you're doing a genocide run. And, oh wait, no, because there's that, uh, right. Actually, I am going to just quickly try dinner! Eat your greens. That's a hint. Take the green attack. Good. That's a choice. No betrayal doesn't work, unfortunately. Yes, I ate my greens, Vegetoid. I'll cackle you up very softly. You're about to be diced, Vegetoid. Then I'll eat you. Ah! But yeah, I wasn't using yellow names. Because whenever you eat your greens for Vegetoid, that Vegetoid is now like, okay, you can have mercy. Ah, damn it, it's this puzzle. Yeah, this puzzle's that easy. Just click the one behind the pillar. Next one should be the red one. Yep. And then it's the red one. And then if I'm not mistaken, it's the one behind this pillar. Nope. I was wrong. It's the one behind the middle. Middle pillar. Middle pillar? Middle pillar. It's this one. Yep. And there we go. The spikes are tracked. 
and we'll just grab the toy knife and we'll call this apart. All right. So, I hope you enjoyed. It was somewhat boring just because it's the beginning of the game. Hopefully I'm not going to be like half sobbing, regretting my choice part way through the game because I can't do that. This is true genocide. I have to kill everything. That's all the ending I have left. Unfortunately. But in the meantime, I hope you enjoyed. My name is Brody, Texas Damascar, and I'll be signing off until, well... I'm just gonna sit the okay. I'll just start the recording from, um, my room clearance right now. And I'll have that uploaded either tonight or it'll be on tomorrow or early in the morning. But I'll get this uploading today. I hope you enjoyed. Subscribe, flavor it, enjoy the video, and I will see you next time.